I'm going to show you how to attach a BNC connector to a Cat5 cable using this video baling. The first thing we need to do is get rid of the outer covering and get to the wires inside. We'll take our utility knife. Just score it a little bit. Bend it. Pull it off. Okay, now we have different sets, different colors of wire. Let's go ahead and separate them out. Okay, we got one, two, three, four, four sets of different color, and they're twisted together. And of the sets, one solid and one striped. Now, this right here is a little rip cord. Let's go ahead and just get that out of the way. It's a little string. Okay. Now we got to pick out one set for a video. And that's the set that's actually going to go and fit into this video band. And let's choose the green. Okay. And the rest of these are going to be our power supply. We're going to connect those together, but to do that, we need to strip off the ends. Gonna go ahead and strip all those. All right, now that we have them stripped down, what we're gonna do, except for the green, because that's gonna be your video, we're gonna untwist these and we're gonna attach all the solid colors together and all the striped colors together. So let's separate them out. Okay, now I want all the solid colors together. Okay, now I want all those stripe colors together. Okay, so I'm going to take all these solids and I'm going to twist the ends together. Take all these striped and twist them all together. Now it's all right to combine for your power supply, but you don't want to combine the wires for the video because that's going to make for a poor quality. Okay. Okay. Now we're ready to attach our video side to our video bailing. As you can see on this end we have the B and C and then on this end we're going to insert our wires, our video wires. We have two little slots, one for positive and negative. Okay, let's take our Cat5 cable. And remember we decided to use green for video. Now we're not going to untwist these but we are going to insert the exposed wires into the positive and negative. So solid positive, stripe negative. Okay, I've inserted them in the slots. Now we just gotta lock them down with the screwdriver. As you can see, we're done. We've attached our BNC connector to our Cat5 cable using our video baling. Now, remember, the other two wires that are left over, they're going to be for your power supply. And make sure you use your solid for your positive and your striped for your negative.